Well, good morning, everybody. I'm coming to you for today's Daily Video Devo in a very unusual spot since we talked about the very first sign miracle of Jesus Christ in the Gospel of John this last weekend, which was turning water into wine. I thought I would talk to a local wine expert who's also a regular attender at Twin Lakes Church in his place of business. I'm at the Bargetto Winery here in Soquel with John Bargetto. Good morning, Renee. It's so good to see you. Well, I, I, I wanted to talk to you because the other day you were telling me that this is my favorite miracle. <laughs> and it's probably not a surprise to any of us, but uh, but why is it your, your favorite miracle? Naturally, he's a winemaker. And we were going to see Christ as not only a winemaker, but a great winemaker. He didn't right. make mediocre wine. Right. He made great wine. Right. Um, it's his first. It's done at Cana. And on the surface, it's about joy and generosity. Mm -hmm. Wine mm -hmm. brings joy to life. One enjoyed in moderation, of course. Mm -hmm. And Christ does it in such a generous way. So okay. generous. So yes. abundantly. Yes. I'm sure there was plenty of... Uh, wine at the at the wedding and i'm sure it was good wine because mm -hmm. that, that's what they would serve sure but then he created even a wine better than that right and it's sort of the best is saved for last exactly right i think about we as christians living our life you know with the joys and the struggles mm. um but we are people of hope yes and the best is yet to come right and that's right. our christian hope this miracle is about turning water into wine, but it also is reflective of just the way Jesus works. As mm -hmm. you said, mm -hmm. it's about joy. Mm -hmm. It's about the best is yet to come. It's right. about hope. It's just yes. so beautiful. Yes. On so many levels, it, Jesus doesn't just do miracles. It's like he's doing poetry mm. with, with miracles. Mm. Right, and I right. think of John 10, 10, where Jesus says, I have come to bring you life and life abundantly, right? Right. He's not stingy, right? Right. right. You know? gen generosity, overflowing, yeah, overflowing love. Yeah, literally. like you said, it could have, it, if he had made, you know, two gallons of two buck chuck yeah. out of water, yeah, that would have been, been amazing. Yeah, they all they were all tipsy. <laughs> but it's but fun. it's a thousand gallons yeah. or what yeah. a thousand yeah. bottles yeah. of yeah. the about best wine ever. Three uh, barrels. Uh, yeah, that's three right. barrels. That's so that's lot. what it is. About what he made. It's about three yeah. of these barrels. It's yeah. so, so abundant. It's yeah. just fantastic. Well, thank you for taking this time you. in your beautiful wine cellar here. And it just helps us to picture this and to, and to get more, more appreciation for what Jesus did. God bless you guys. Thanks for joining us. Have a great day.